doing. Hi everyone. Oh, the light is bad. There we are. Um, so we are on day three of our gonal F injections and we are at um, someone from ch our church owns Dahlia Haven, which is full of dahlias as you can see. Oh, that sun is bright. And so we're just having a wander around looking at some of the pretty flowers. So we will show you some of them. Um, and then we get to cut some. Are you just going to pull that funny face the whole time? <laughs> yes, yes. Um, yeah, so injections are going okay-ish. They hurt a little bit. The gonal F ones are kind of scary because they're so much bigger. Anyway, should we have a wander around? <laughs> wander around daily even. <laughs> So these are just some of the flowers around here. They are pretty amazing colours. And there's some that are really little and some that are huge, but we'll show you more as we go along. That's pretty. So they've got some fenced off for a wedding that we can't pick, but we can pick any of them that we like. Which is pretty sweet of them to be able to do that for people. Can you get out of Oh and there's just rows upon rows upon rows of beautiful flowers and it's such a gorgeous day today it was meant to be rain apparently so the fact that we've got good weather is pretty awesome there's another one they're all so pretty it's going to be hard to pick which ones we like this one looks like So we're just about to leave Daily Haven and this is the sunset. It is pretty beautiful and amazing. It's just gorgeous. And the clouds today have just been beautiful. And I hope that the video kind of captures see ya, the beauty of the clouds today. Ah, oh, it's good to live in New Zealand. Alright, so we're all done at Daily Haven. I had to do my injection in the car again, which was fun. I brought my um, gonal F in um, our cooler bag thing that they gave us with, with an ice pick, so it's all um, well refrigerated and stuff, which is cool. So it's been a pretty cool afternoon. They fed us, it was, you know, free dinner, so yeah, but it was still free. Um, and we got lots of flowers, which are all in the back seat. And there's another bunch <laughs> back there. But I'll show you that when we get home. Um, and I've put them in a vase and stuff like that. So it was a cool evening. We were definitely some of the youngest people there. <laughs> uh, all the oldies were there. But that's all right. Did you have a fun time, Michael? Was it good? It was as good as it could be. Yeah. So everyone, these are our final flowers that we got from Dahlia Haven. Um, these are the, this is the little um, pom-pom ones in a little vase and just some pink ones in a vase. Hi everyone, so today is day five of Gonal F injections. Um, I'll be taking the fifth one, I think I'm up to the fifth one tonight, which is quite good. Might be five or six, anyway, somewhere around there. Um, I'm feeling much better than I was last week. The last kind of three or four days since I've been on the Gonal F, I've been feeling better. Um, feeling a bit more normal. I'm still really tired and quite lethargic and stuff, but I'm just feeling a ton better. Um, so yeah, we've been going really well with that. Um, the last few times I've done the Gonal F, um, Mike has been helping me just with, I'll put the, the needle in and then he pushes the end because it's quite, the EpiPen is quite a big thing. I have a whole new level of respect um, and just applaud anyone who has diabetes that has to do these injections daily by themselves. It's just um, something that's quite difficult to get used to and I just really applaud you for doing, for doing them um, every day of your life like it's not even a big deal so thumbs up to you people um how i'm feeling i'm yeah feeling tired i keep breaking out every now and then i keep getting zits all over the place it's really not that attractive but other than that it's just the tiredness that's driving me up the wall otherwise i'm feeling there's days where i feel 
really hopeful and excited and in these days where I'm just so nervous about is this going to work, is it going to be a waste of time um, but you just got to kind of keep hopeful and you know when you have those days I guess you got to grant yourself a little bit of grace and, and move on so yeah today I'm feeling good today I'm feeling excited and happy and um, yeah just hopeful and I've been I've I've bought a whole lot of baby books um, on pregnancy and also the first like year of your child's life and I've been wanting to read those as well just to kind of start getting I don't know I feel like I'm doing something other than just an injection once a day it kind of feels like a non-event so so today is the day we go in for our blood test and our um, scan to see how the eggs are coming along um, so we're just on our way to Green Lane to go and do the internal scan I had my blood test this morning and the traffic is just horrendous Grr. Um, so yeah so we'll let you know how the appointment goes So we're all done. I've got seven follicles in the left ovary and 13 in the right. So there were heaps in the right um, and they were all a really good size. So what they've done is they've increased my bursarelin injection to 40, 40 units as opposed to 20 um, to make sure that my body doesn't uh, ovulate naturally. and. They're going to ring me at about 2 o'clock to let me know what, how much gonal F I need to be taking. She also gave me the trigger um, ready to go for when they ring and let me know when I need to take that. So I'll probably have to go in for another blood test tomorrow, which is not a big deal. Um, I'll just, yeah, have to, I'll just go to the one closer to home than the one all the way out here. Um, and it's nice that I don't have to go in for another scan. Obviously, they're happy with my my follicles. And, yeah, I think the doctor was just a little bit worried about how many I had in, in the one ovary. Um, but I'm, I'm actually really over the moon. I'm stoked that we have so many follicles and we don't have to be worrying about mm. not having enough to use. So, yeah, it's all go from here, babe. Plenty of follicles. Plenty. Plenty. So many.